Do you need to do dancing fingers for me? Be sure that the hand is not locked. The fingers can move. Great, now put your fingers on there. What we're gonna do is we're gonna slowly lift up our fingers. So we lift up the pinky, go to the first finger, hold them on, and then go rotate to the pinky. Rotate to the first finger, rotate to the pinky. Okay. First finger, fourth finger. First finger, fourth finger. You will find many times this is very difficult for students is to actually rotate to the fourth finger because we oftentimes get locked and what we're doing is not locking our bow. Okay. Let's do that again. Go to the first finger, two middle fingers, pinky. Middle fingers, first finger, middle fingers, fourth finger. Middle fingers, first finger, middle fingers. Good, now take a look at your elbow position as you're doing this, okay? So when we get to the first finger, pinky, middle finger, first finger, elbow up, middle finger, elbow down. But doesn't that feel very easy? You feel very easy to raise. And you guys can obviously do this with pencil as well. The first finger, the pinky. Then we divide our bow hand actually into three parts. The bottom, which is gonna be the fourth finger, the two middle fingers, number two, first finger, three. Okay, and be sure that elbow is going like that so that, that this goes and works together as a unit. Oftentimes people will just sit there and do that and they're not raising their, you know, they're raising tension in their shoulder because somewhere you have to lift as you rotate. Okay. So let's do that one more time. First finger, middle fingers, middle fingers. And okay, now we're going to go to the pinky. Hold your bow just with your pinky and your thumb. Right. That feel weird. And then put your other fingers on the bow. So now you can see that you're really engaging the muscle here. I don't know if you can feel it. I, I really feel that engagement for us. Okay. This one, we have good flexibility. Very, very good. Great. Now, one of the things that you can also do for flexibility is to take a pencil or a pen and pick your paper for a minute like this, and we're going to take the pencil and draw circles. And do this one. And you engage the one we just did, pinky the first finger, pinky the first finger. It's like stirring the pot. Right? Can you stir the pot for me with your pencil? Good. Now, and it's easier to do it on a flat table, of course, but try that for me. And just doing the circles, keeping your wrist without moving, and engage your pinky, first finger. Go in reverse for me. Isn't that interesting to go the other direction? Gonna go the other way for me. 